this machine doesn't come with any uh, manual or any link online uh, how to use or how to maintain very well made machine but it said millimeter you know in the United States we don't use millimeter so I'm thinking man this guy got to be smarter than that I mean they they build a well built machine so first I'm going to try something I'm going to try to lose the screw back here just in case so I can move this unit around and I'm going to take the tool they provide you Gonna take the knob out and see what happened. Okay. There's an O ring there, so it tell me that this thing is you know free spinning. And there's an O ring down there. And behold, we got inch. So since I'm in the United States, I'm going to use the, the, the inch instead of the millimeter. Put it back in. Basically, make sure this all the way out, bottom out. Put this back on. Okay. And put it, crank the dial to zero. Okay. And then pretty much hold this in play and hand tighten the sucker and make, make sure that knob is like this, see it? you gotta hold this so it won't move because it's the o-ring is what holding it tighten it more if you need to you can use this tool but finger tight is good now this whole unit should move There we go. See? Zero. You bring you crank it like this. It raises the dial up and it makes the uh, the slug uh heavier, longer. Hope that helps somebody uh new to the press just like I am. Thanks for watching.